What up? Just out here hanging out at Etnies today, um, enjoying my view. Because what I can see right now is I got two new shoe models that just came out. I got my, my shoe, and then I got the new DBK shoe. So I just ca actually came down to see them right now for the first time off of paper. And i uh, got to say I'm pretty damn excited. So my shoes, obviously, I like smaller shoes now, and I like black shoes. And this shoe right here for me is... I love this shoe, this style of this shoe, the Jameson 2 before it was even mine. Like I've been wanting to get this shoe in my style forever. And mm -hmm. what I did this year is I tried to make it go with my bike pretty much. So I got, um, we put some of the elephant print on here. And I like, I like matte shoes. So to, to have this material and this sole and everything just black and with the blue. And of course all my favorite stuff on the inside of the shoe is um, pretty key. I always like to, to put what I'm into into my shoes. and. I found that whatever I usually like, a lot of my fans like, so this one's for you guys. Yeah, no, and definitely not me just throwing my name on a shoe. Like, I've always come down, we'll have meetings, and I'll show them. I'll, whenever I see anything I like, like on Instagram or Twitter or anything, like I always screenshot it and send it to them. Like, hey, I like this style, or I like, I like this pattern, or I like this color, and I just give it to them and let them work their magic, because obviously they're the ones that make the shoes and know what's good and, and what sells, and I think with both of our styles together, it's a no-brainer having this new shoe out. For me to come out on my own shoe is like, I never thought in, in the world this would ever happen, you know what I mean? Like, I'm a dirt bike rider, I don't, I'm not a skater, you know what I mean? Like, to me it's just, it's just the perks of riding for Etnies. I've been at Etnies for about 15 years now, so it's like family over here. So if I want something, usually I just say it and I get it. And if they tell me no, it's for a good reason. So I'm just pumped that I have had such a good relationship with these guys over here. And I'm not a dude that likes to bounce around from sponsor to sponsor, so. You can say I'm a lifer over here at Etnies. So the other hand, I got the new DBK shoe, which I'm pumped on. DBK has been doing really good lately, and for Etnies to team up with me and, 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 and do something that I really wanted to do, and I wanted to give the fans like a dope shoe to go with the clothes and and just make everyone pumped on Dirt by Kids. And right now, just to come out with the new shoe, which is it's almost the same color. It's, it is the exact same colorway of my shoe. I like to keep them close together but also give the fans something a little bit different. Like I know a lot of more people wear this shoe, the, the LS Fader, it's been really popular over the years. And for me on this one, we actually threw some bigger branding on it and threw some more elephant print, plus the Dirt by Kids logo on the back, the tongue and inside the shoe. So like I said, this is like one of my favorite colorways right here. And I, I, I tried to make it go with my bike as much as possible without making a corny shoe because I'm, I'm if, if the shoe's coming out, I have to wear it and I have to make it my style. And with well, my style and any styles together, like I said, it's a no brainer. And this shoe right here, I'm super pumped on. Yeah, I'm really surprised with how big DBK has been blowing up and how quick it's been growing. And, and, and for all the stores to be hitting us up, like wanting it, like to me, it's like, I'm like, yeah, all right, so we are doing something good right now, you know? Like for me, it was just pretty much like our crew, what everybody called it. And we we're like, oh, we're dirt by kids, you know? And for us to have a whole clothing line and now coming out with shoes with Etnies, like I'm pumped, man. And, and, and right now, I'm really excited because both the shoes right now are available in store. So if you want them, you can go get them. If not, you can hate on it and not go get it. Um, in my house, I definitely have way more shoes than my wife. Like it used to be the other way around. She used to have walls of them. Now I got, I got walls and my whole entire floor. Like I get pissed off because I have to kick shoes out of the way to get to my clothes because there, I have like in my closet, I probably literally have 40, 50 pairs of shoes. Half of them are brand new. I get them dirty, I go get on a new pair. <laughs> I have like my certain ones that I use to go riding, and I have my certain ones I use for the gym, and then I have like all my clean ones that I wear up randomly. Like I just love, like I'll just stockpile all my shoes, and I, do, I can't keep them in boxes. I love to see what I have laid out. I'm like, all right, that will go good with this shirt. Or I'll keep these shoes until I get a shirt that matches these shoes. So it's definitely the perks of riding Bretonnies is having boxes and boxes and boxes of shoes on top of more boxes of shoes. Yeah, I always get compliments on my shoes, and I think the one reason is, I don't know, Etnies makes dope shoes, and like I said, I've been there for 15 years now, and to have some of the best shoes in the game, you always get compliments on them. But like you said, like with the Scout, the Scout's one of my favorite shoes. It's it's uh, it's so light, and like I, that's the shoe I use to work out in all the time, too, and running around, jumping in it. It's just a good, solid shoe, and like the other day, I, I got pissed because I couldn't find any slippers around the house, so I just cut the whole back of the shoe off and made my own slippers. Sometimes you gotta work with what you got. If you got scissors, you just cut your shoes up. And that's the perk too, is I can cut as many shoes up as I want and still call it and get more. 